Okay, welcome back. Hey, today we're going to be tying up uh, some squirmy wormies. Tying up some uh, flies for a co-worker of mine who is uh, breaking out his fly rod for this spring, he said. Normally a spin fisherman. So I told him I'd get him a couple flies. A little squirmy with a little lead on it. What I have in the vise is a wholesale fly company. Size 12, uh, Scud Caddis hook. And I want to start with a little bit of 0.015 lead wire. Just a couple of wraps. One, two, four, five, six. Six is good. Don't want a lot of weight, just want enough to get it uh, started uh, downward in the water. I don't like he's bouncing on the bottom. I like him just above the uh, above the bottom, bobbing along there. All right, position the lead in the middle. Danville, 140 denier in hot pink. Start on right in front of the lead. Take one wrap in behind it. Center it right in the middle of the hook. Couple of wraps over top of it. All right, let's take that uh, thread back behind the lead. Let's cut away the tag end. Now we're going to add this uh, squirming material. I got this batch here at uh, Risen Fly Fishing. I got some gold in it. That uh, actually gives you a good clump of it. This uh, cost me, I believe, five bucks. And I'm going to use one strand. It's a pretty long strand, so I'm going to cut it in half. Just take it to, to the end there, just snip it right in half here. I'm going to use half of this. First, you need to start with a pin trap, right where you parked your thread. Just measure out how long do you want to tail. Go about that long. One pinch, pull the squirmy up, pinch it in between your fingers and wrap back up against it. Just give it a little pinch as you go here. Take your thread back up forward, work it up front. I'm going to add just a bit of Super glue. This is a Loctite super glue. This is the one that I've found does not melt this material. I've also used uh, other super glue. The uh, Gorilla Glue super glue worked well, but I found that Gorilla super glue goes bad on you quicker. This Loctite never seems to go bad on me. <clears throat> so, with a little glue on there, spread it out. Bend it over. Just with gentle wraps. Let me get uh, so you can see it in the camera here. Gentle wraps. Do not put a lot of pressure on it. You're not trying to stretch it on there. Just a little gentle wrap. That super glue will adhere it. Take your Thread, capture it. Just give it about uh, three or four wraps. Pull it back. Wrap in front of the material, pinching it back a little bit. And now we're going to give it a wrap right over the middle. Get your whip finish tool. We'll give it a couple whips. Don't need for any more glue because it uh, already glued on there pretty good. Cut it away. And there you go. You got your squirmy wormy. Just a little bit of lead on there. Just enough to get her sinking on a uh, number size 12 scud hook. With uh, The Loctite is kind of the key. Don't use anything like uh, Sally Hansen's or head cement. It all... Uh, It'll melt this material. 
this Loctite super glue seems to be the best that I've found and I've been buying this for a while and mainly because of the little brush alright appreciate you watching my videos thanks for sticking around thanks for uh, subscribing and liking and all that good stuff that you do and I hope these work out for you these are very durable I'm going to show you an example this one here is an older one that I've tied up a while back it's still hanging around and let me show you these two of these right here this is from my video that I did three years ago and they've been in my box in the back of my truck in the bed of my truck with a hardcover on it in the hot sun I park it in the garage door when I'm home but at work it stays out in the hot sun for a couple days at a time so these been very durable it's called the Stormy Quattro if you want to see how I tied these. Basically it's still tied similar but uh, with the same glue and everything. So you can see how they've held up for several years. This one here and another one. These are the last two I had left. Alright, well I appreciate you watching. See you next time. Stay safe out there and cheers.